Mr. Speaker, the Federal Court of Canada couldn't be clearer in its 190-page ruling. In 2022, there was no justifiable reason to invoke the Emergencies Act. The Liberal government's use of the act directly violated Canadians' most essential rights to freedom of thought, belief, opinion, and expression. The decision to invoke the Emergencies Act was unnecessary from the start. For Canadians to have any faith in our democracy, the Liberals must show that they understand the court decision and have learned their lesson. They should drop their plans to appeal and promise to abide by the Constitution instead of breaking the law. When will the Prime Minister admit that he was wrong, apologize to Canadians of his actions, and drop the appeal? The importance of maintaining the rule of law, questioning the reliance on emergency legislation, and recognizing encroachments on Canadian rights, legal structures, and the Charter of Rights and Freedoms. It suggests that the alignment of values criticizing emergency laws and actions by Justin Trudeau's government with Canadian ideals is uncertain. Conservative concerns about individual freedoms and their critique of liberal government actions can be seen as protecting Canadians' essential rights to freedom of thought, belief, opinion, and expression. The call for an apology highlights the need for acknowledging violations against these freedoms, emphasizing individual autonomy and authenticity, argues that current violations against ideas and freedom of expression seem to conflict with democratic principles, suggesting a lack of democracy in Canada under Trudeau's leadership. It stresses the importance of accountability, admitting wrongdoing, issuing a sincere apology, and retracting appeals to rebuild public trust and address perceived rights infringements.